hi there and welcome back and let us continue and on the previous lecture we have learned about how to build up our splash activity and in this section we are going to learn about how to create our network helper that will help us to test whether there is an active network connection or not so let's go and get started first of all create a new package over here and call it as uh, utils and inside this util let us create a new Kotlin class and I'll create an object and name it as an ETWRK network HEL network helper. Okay, so we have an object of okay. a and then we will create a function. So, function I'll say each uh, NETWRK uh, network CO and then you see each network connected and this should return the type of the boolean. So, with the True or false, right? And uh, then I will create another function over here that should be of the private and private function and check and it the water network connection. Okay, so we have a two function over here, and this will require a context. So I'll just say context of the con context. And I'll create a, a val over, or I'll say val, and uh, that should be of the let's say a result which is of equals to default value as a false. And over here we will check the context dot get the system service, and here we need to get the system service. So I'll just context dot the connectivity service. Yeah, we need a connectivity service as a connectivity service as a connectivity service as a uh, connectivity manager okay and then I'll just apply a function over here and we'll go to the manifest over here and we need uh, some permission apply use permission Android the internet we need to check Another one is a uh, use permission, which is of access network state. Okay, so I'll just add a two permission over here and go over here, and I'll check for the build condition. So if uh, if the build uh, condition is whether the higher than the Android Lollipop or lower than the Android Lollipop, so a different way to do. I'll just make use of the build uh, version over here build dot the version dot sorry i need to import the build first just import dot uh, this the sdk int is greater than equals to uh, build dot the version code dot m so we have a lollipop and then uh, we have a else part where we will check if it is lower than the version of the android lollipop and uh, here uh, we will pass a uh, two parameter over here. One is a connection uh, manager, and another one is of the network. This can be of the null level type, and this is also a return type of the uh, boolean. So let us have a boolean, and uh, then over here we will check for that condition result. Which is of a result which is of equals to uh, check for the check for the network connection and here we need to pass the uh, connectivity manager which is of uh, this right correct connectivity manager we have and the active network so we need to pass the network so that is the this dot the active network we need to pass and access at the access network state so i think access network state is already added why it is giving me add the permission did i made a access network state it's already added but i i'm not sure why why it uh, asked me to re add it is it the same or is it the different ones i think i added the same one right 
I'm not sure what happened that one, but that should be fine. Okay, so we have our result over here. And then uh, for the low version of the Android, let's say for the KitKat version, we check the val for the network, which is of equal to this dot the all network, we get the all network. And I'll just use for four. And I'll just say this is of our networks and for NATWRK network in networks right so network in networks then uh, we will say if we check for the if condition if the check network connection and they will pass the connectivity manager as this and the network over there we need to pass the network okay and if that is true then we, we will return the result is of equals to true and here there finally at the end we will return true or not it true uh, return the result yeah. and that should be fine and uh, let me arrange it okay so let's go over here now since we have uh, call that function from here and here we need to find out whether we have an active connection so how do we check is the connectivity manager dot uh, get the network capabilities so we we'll make use of the network capabilities and we need to pass the network so we already have a network we will pass that one and then we will make use of our uh, let's say also and now we have a network capabilities over here if you see we have a network capabilities and now we can check for if network capability dot has the transport right has the transport of the network capabilities dot the transport of the wi-fi so which means that if it has the wi-fi connection then uh, we will return true which means there is a internet or the wi-fi connection and another one is uh, we will make use of the else if condition else if has the has transport and transport of the network capabilities dot i will check for the cellular so your phone basically has the wi-fi or the cellular for the internet connection Bluetooth we are not going to check and Ethernet also and the VPN. So we are just going checking for Wi-Fi or the cellular network. So if there is of these two, then we should uh, return uh, return the true. Right? And then otherwise we have to finally return the false, which means that there is no internet connection. Okay, so we have added this function uh, object and we have added a two function over here so but now we need to call this okay so let's go to the activity over here slash activity and on the delay after let's see this is not required but uh this is just for the demo i'm adding a delay for in your actual code you should not add any de delay that that is a very bad practice so just for the demo i'm just adding uh to show you to a delay over here because if we don't have delay then you cannot actually see the splash screen so it may be very fast right so we just uh, want to add some delay to get a look on the splash activity and here i'll check for the condition if network helper we have a network helper that is connected and here i need to pass the context so let's say this at splash activity we pass it and if the return is true that means there is a network connection then i can move on to the next activity which is of main activity else part and uh, we will just create a let's say let's create a snack bar dot uh, make and the view so i need a view so i will go over here and add a main layout so i have added an id for this layout if you have an add just add the layout id so you can just add any one so i have added the main layout so i'll just add a main layout so for that i'll just go over here well 
and I'll just say main layout which is of equals to find view by ID and it should be of CUN SQR and constraint layout and that should be of the r.id dot the main layout okay so now we have a main layout and i'll pass that main layout over here and the text i will just say that i can just go to the values and go to the string and here i'll just say string name uh let's say a uh, um, message no no network right what i get no network so and then you see here no network connection and uh, then here we will pass say sorry uh there each sorry sorry s o r r y sorry and there each uh, no net Work should be of a network. Uh, sorry, there is no network to you and see connection. Please, please try later. Okay, so we have this message, and I'll just make use of that string. So I'll just say get get the string or the, the string dot we have the message no internet connection okay and then another parameter that we have to pass is the duration so as an snack bar dot uh, let's keep as uh, indefinite right just keep indefinite for now we don't want to close it and finally dot so that message i think i'll move it to the second line okay so we, I think we have all done over here. So uh, I just need to now run my application. So let us run the application and let us check whether we are able to produce this both. So first is launch the main activity and second is to show this snack bar. Uh, so uh, let's wait for the application to come up. And I'll go over here. You can see that please wait. And after two seconds, we are able to actually go to the main activity and I've, i disabled the network connection over here now and let us try to run our application and uh, let us see that we should see our toast message over here yeah sorry there is no network connection please try later so which means that we have now successfully implemented how to check for the network connection as well as this plus activity so if you want to remove this particular delay and uh, then i can uh, just go and particularly add a network connection and then we will just rerun the application and then you can see that we are on the main activity so if i uh, launch the application one more time where is that application uh, is shop and which means that we it's too fast to actually see that splash activity but if you want to actually see then we have to add this one and um, because this is already fast right so it, it takes already less time so it's not uh, possible to cast that splash screen and so i'm just adding a delay over here let's see for one second or you can just this is just for the demo just make sure this is just for your your practice session or the demo never add a delay in your actual production code so that's uh, you're actually delaying your application and uh, i think that's all and uh, we will meet up in the next lecture and uh, we'll do something more on this so let's meet up in the next lecture till then have a great day